So Governor Cuomo had a press conference. And us, you know, the rest of the world that wasn't able to be there, is extremely fortunate that Lisa Evers was in attendance. And so uh, I got a video, Lisa Evers, talking about stuff that, may, that part of me, Governor Cuomo, said. And uh, I got some words after that. So check this out. Me and the Notification Gang would like to invite everybody to come join us Monday through Thursday, 9.20 to 10 o'clock for Morning Coffee, where we discuss the events of the prior day and also just talk mess about stuff. See you then. Oh, Black Dynamite, I wish it was that simple, but this is much bigger than you and me. Hey, little mama. It may be bigger than you, and it may be bigger than me, but it ain't bigger than you and me. Can you dig it? I hope you're having a really good Tuesday. Unfortunately, we have some not so good news here from New York City, which is now the epicenter of the coronavirus epidemic here in the United States. Governor Cuomo gave us a briefing today, and one of the things that he said that really uh, struck me was that the number of coronavirus cases in New York State is doubling every three days. I took my notes, some of my notes, because I want to make sure I give you the exact information. So think about that. Number of coronavirus cases doubling every three days. Right now in New York State, more than 25,000 confirmed cases. We have many cases, about half of those are in New York City, uh, about 200 deaths uh, from the coronavirus here in New York State, about half of those are in New York City. And again, one of the other statistics that we really need to keep in mind is that just over half of the cases that are happening of the half of the new coronavirus cases are in people ages 18 to 49. That's incredible. So I think that this, that's something really important to keep in mind is that this is now something that is affecting everybody. Of course, we're most concerned about the vulnerable people, about those who can't take care of themselves. But what is most important is that everybody is at risk. So the governor also said, and this is another thing that we have to really take seriously, and I want you to think about as you plan your life, plan your activities, also your budget and everything that you, um, you know, as you're trying to go around and just organize your life, actually not go around, actually stay at home and try to organize your life in this new era. I mean, the truth is we have never dealt with anything like this before. I was here for 9-11. BB in. Jack Frost. What's up, party people? I so. Yeah. So. Apparently. New York City. Is basically the epicenter. As far as the most cases. Of the coronavirus in the United States. Okay, so before we go any further, there was a uh, press conference that the New York State governor had, uh, Cuomo. There was a, a press conference that he had. And in this press conference, um, he spoke on a couple of things. And as y'all can see, that was Lisa Evers. Shout out to Lisa Evers, legendary in the in the world of hip-hop media um and just media in general let's just be clear on that so basically what happened is they're right now saying new york city has the most cases and i'm guessing deaths also and is growing at the most rapid rate i'm just assuming that and i'm hoping that it's not more than doubling every three days in another place because that would that would just be terrible i mean think about it is you got 10,000 today, three days from now, it's going to be 20,000. Three days from that, it's going to be 40,000. Three days from that, it's going to be 80,000. That's doubling every three days. Get it? So, please, first of all, everybody, stay safe out there. Make sure that you keep yourself well protected. If you do not have any real reason to go somewhere, stay at home. Also, number one thing that they've also been saying don't um shout out to dr oz dr oz was on uh the breakfast club also shout out to the breakfast club dr oz was on the breakfast club and one of the things that he said that i think is real important that we have to pay attention to is dr oz says soap and water works better well it kills the virus more thoroughly than hand sanitizer 
So please stop hand sanitizing if washing your hands with soap and water is an option. You understand? Some like I understand people want to get from one spot to another quick and you're like, hey, they go to sink, but got to turn the knob, put my hand under it. Then I got to get the soap. This is going to take too long. Hand sanitizer, two seconds. I understand. I get that. Let's just start spending a couple of extra moments to make sure that we are taking the best care to ensure our safety and therefore the safety of the individuals that come in contact with us. With all that being said, let me know what y'all guys think about the video. Um, I want to know what y'all think about uh, what Lisa Evans reported on. That's basic. That's basically um, Governor Cuomo that had the press conference. Let me know what y'all guys think about that, especially the fact that it's doubling every three days think about that for a moment now i'm not gonna go into whether i'm on the side of the people that says it's just a, a, a mutated flu virus or the they got people i heard somebody say something about aliens so yeah i'm not going into all of that all i'm saying is this is an actual thing please let's follow the directions of the um people who are actually went to school <laughs> and have training in order to be prepared for things like this, like our our medical field, please follow the direction of the medical field and anybody out there that come across any um, uh, police or anything or, or National Guards, just acquiesce, just do the thing that they actually do. Let's not make a bad situation already worse. Uh, let's stay from outside, even though outside is fun. Right now it's inside times. Leave some comments down below. I do want to know what y'all think about this, that the fact that it's doubling every three days in New York City. I think that's just incredible. Like, comment, subscribe. Join the notification gang. Hashtag Bronx Bombers. Let's get it. I love y'all. Take care of each other. Hug the kids for me. I haven't forgotten about you. And that's all I got on this one. I'm out. If you like this video, please hit the like and subscribe button. If you would like to help dictate the direction that this channel takes, please leave a comment. All comments are appreciated, whether positive or negative. Thank you very much and enjoy your day. And remember, positive thoughts cause for positive things to happen. Let's get it. Oh, Black Dynamite, I wish it was that simple, but this is much bigger than you and me. Hey, little mama, it may be bigger than you and it may be bigger than me, but it ain't bigger than you and me. Can you dig it?